What up Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's Matt and this high school basketball playoff video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your team's next event. We're coming live from Cal State Northridge as St. Anthony takes on Sierra Canyon in the second game of the Open Division Pool A bracket. Saints coming off a disappointing loss against Etiwanda on Friday, while Sierra Canyon is coming off a dominating win against St. John Bosco. Early on, BJ Boston is going to make this easy layup, but don't worry, Saints fans. Gordon Boykins is going to get it right back as he's going to make this nice little floater over Harold Yu, Sierra Canyon's seven footer. Saints struggled with offense all night, but their defense stepped up as Elijah Price is going to block this Boston layup attempt. Get out of here. And Zaire Williams is going to find a cutting Amari Bailey for the easy dunk here. It was that type of night for the Blazers as they would take advantage of second chance opportunities as Williams is going to put this rebound back up for the layup. And Sierra Cannon would continue to roll as Tukey Wigginton would find Shy Odom for the dunk. And the Trail Blazers would take a 17-4 lead after the first quarter. In the second quarter, the Saints got a lift from Makai Williams and Corey Brown, but... After this three, Sierra Cannon's lead would be cut to 23-17 heading into halftime, and the student section is loving it as the Saints have some life. In the third quarter, this three from Brown would cut the lead to 25-20, but Sierra Cannon would clamp down. It was just that type of night. Although a couple guys got things going, Saints just needed a little bit more of a lift offensively in this one. Williams would find Harold Yu for this dunk, and that's the story of the third as a 13-5 run would put the game out of reach for the Saints. Sierra Cannon would go on to win the game 61-49 as they move on to the championship game of the Pool A bracket, and the Saints will be back in action to wrap up Pool A play on Friday when they host St. John Bosco. For all coverage of that game and the rest of your local sports, you got to keep it right here at the562.org.